How's it going everyone? I'm Andrew with Speed Tech Lights and welcome to the episode of Speed Tech Spotlight. In this episode we're going to go over the green steady burn override cable on our Z surface mounts. So first up we'll go over our TIR series using the green steady burn override cable. So you'll see here I have my Z3 TIR in red. Now since this is a single color model you'll notice when I take the green cable to my positive connection that my unit will steady burn in the color order of my unit. For example, this one is red, so you'll be in flashing mode in red, and then when you use your green steady burn override cable, your unit will go to steady burn red. Now another really cool feature with our green steady burn override cable is you can have independent power using the green cable. So if I take the green cable alone to power, you'll see my unit will go to steady burn. Or if I take my red cable, you'll see that my unit will be in flashing mode. So this is perfect if you wanted one switch to have your unit flashing, and then if you wanted to take your green cable and for example, hook it up to your brake line, you can easily do that using the green cable here with your steady burn function. Now, if you would like your steady burn color to be clear rather than the color ordered of your unit in our TIR optic, we do offer our Z6 TIR super takedown which I brought here in amber. Now you'll see my unit will be flashing in amber, but when I take my green steady burn override cable to the positive connection, you'll see my unit will go to steady burn clear. And again, your green cable does have independent power, so you can hook up your green cable to another switch if you would like to, and you'll have a steady burn white work light if you would need to with our TIR optic. And then when you go back, you'll go back to flashing. And the steady burn feature does override the flashing functionality of your unit whenever you do hold power to the green cable. And we do offer these units in amber, red, blue, green, and clear in solid and half-half color combinations in our TIR models. Now let's go over our linear models. So here I brought our multicolor linear Z8 and you'll see I brought an amber clear color combination. Now the difference between our linear series and our TIR is our linear is multicolor. So you'll notice my unit is flashing between color A and color B. And for example here, my color A is amber and color B is clear. Now on any of our multicolor units, your unit will activate the secondary color in steady burn using your green steady burn override cable. So on this unit, if I take my green steady burn override cable to the positive connection, you'll see my unit will go to steady burn clear and then back to flashing amber clear. And you can cycle to a flash pattern where you have only amber in your unit if you would like amber in our linear optic and then have clear as the steady burn option there as well. Now finally, I brought our multicolor Z12 linear in a tricolor configuration here in red, blue, clear. Now on this unit, my primary colors are red, blue, and my secondary color is clear. And again, your green steady burn override cable will override the flashing functionality of your unit. And for example, here we'll go to steady burn clear. And again, you do have independent power on your green steady burn override cable. So this is perfect if you want to hook up your unit to a separate switch, if you need a work light or super takedown mode. And again, on our multicolor linear series, that the green steady burn override cable will activate the secondary color of your unit. And on both of these, the secondary color is clear. And we do offer these units in amber, red, blue, green, and clear in our TIR optic or our multicolor linear optic. So you'll see that we have any color for any application. So that covers the green steady burn override cable in our Z surface mounts. If you have any questions, give us a call or shoot us an email. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks.